Hi, we're back. You ever planked on a guy's dick before? No, never. Tundra man, let's do this. That's a tundra stupid. This one is really easy for me. Um, the I stage think that's because he's a... just fucking easy in general. The stage is a bit hit or miss with me. Um, I just, well, I don't like these these little buy robot things. They're not fun. Oh, I see. Yes, I do. Ah! Give me the bolt! Did you get the the grip thing? Yes, I did. Okay. Yeah. You get it? I hate the swans so fucking much. Dude, I'm glad somebody realizes my hate of swans. Jesus, I fucking hate swans. They're so fucking dumb. This is really the only time I like use rush. Yeah, I don't think I've ever done that room the proper way. Yeah. Oh, you know, that's how you store fossils. What, freeze it? No, you just chuck them in there. So, since Cold Man was used to store fossils and shit, right? Yeah. Does that mean this entire place is just Cold Man? Well, I guess. Because this place is storing fossils? Maybe. Dude, Cold Man got a fucking upgrade. Ah, damn it, you fucking dick. That's the one I always get hit by. Hey, look, there's Airman. <laughs> Man, every fucking <clears throat> robot is getting cameos in this state. And there's Rabbit Man. What? Shit. You don't remember Rabbit Man? Rabbit Eggman? No. I just imagined Eggman and fucking... A sexy bunny outfit, and now I want to die. Wow, you're at his stage already. Yep. Okay. This boss is a little weird. I couldn't really figure this one out very easily. Ugh! That's what was happening to me before. I kept getting hit by the spikes up top. I don't want. You got this, Mega Buddy. I know I can do it. There we go. Okay. Can you scoot over? Mm. Sorry. I'm using you as a perch for my head. I know, but it's annoying. Fine, I guess I gotta get in here then. I hate this room so much because of the fucking swan. Just so annoying. By the way, ancient fucking, uh... Yeah, I know. Pikmin. Pikmans. I guess it would be Pikmin, wouldn't it? Yeah, no, they're called Pikman. Yeah, but I'm talking about fl plural. Oh, then, yeah. Okay, there we go. Usually I try to do something cool there, but, uh... Ooh, close one. Why is it that they don't mass produce robot masters? Uh, because they're too unique. I don't think that makes any sense. Still make another one. I don't know, actually. There we go. I usually have troubles with that room as well. I don't know why. But I think lately I've been kind of figuring out a strategy for it. Still don't like it. Alright, here it is, the final stretch. Wait. Okay, there we go. Okay. Jesus, that was a split second to jump right yep. there. You nailed it. Yep. Alright. Not a single death, one E tank used. We'll see if uh, Tundra Man gives me any trouble. No. I don't I think, think he will, but. I think he's gonna give you a ton of trouble. <laughs> A ton drip trouble. Sure. Shit! Who do you think is the recommended first robot Shit. master? What? 
I wonder if this is supposed to be like the first robot I actually faced. Who? Wait, what? I'm sorry, what'd you say? Is he like supposed to be the, the easiest one, like the recommended first robot master? I don't know. Kind of like Tango Man and Mega Man 8. Oh, come on! I am so disappointed in myself there. You died to Tundra Man. I know! I am so disappointed. I don't know why. I know I messed up a couple times. I didn't really expect myself to die already. Ugh. You want to dance? Feel freeze. Feel freeze. I kind of want to see what Tundra looked like initially. Yeah, I know. Look out. Okay. Okay, what are we gonna do? There we go. No damage. Bobongo. A grand finale! Ah. And we're only six minutes in. Sweet. Nice! Yeah. Kind of disappointed I died, but it's alright. Superhero mode does require, like, a lot of precise timing, you know? Like, pinpoint, I should say. And it does require just a lot of practice. If I probably had a month worth of practice with this game, I think I probably would have, you know, probably been able to do this. It's so good. To... Are you sure? Yeah. So who's next? Uh, Torchman. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. Can I interest you in some? Okay, Mega. Uh... What do I think? Are you sure? Are you sure? I'm gonna start buying these because I know I'm gonna use the weapon tanks and such and um in uh yes yeah. in the um. And the Wily Castle and such. So, let's go, Torchman. This is the Robot Master that gives me the most trouble. And it's not his stage, it's his fight. He's the one that's kind of unpredictable to me right now. I have been kind of getting him. The last time I played, I was able to get him in under five, um, you know, lives, but still. Go. By the way, for that, it's always uh, three uh, P shots. Um, for the uh, for the whatever the shield guys, whatever they're called, I forgot their name. Shield children. Sure, that works. Ooh, jeez, I thought I was gonna make that jump. I knew I jumped too early. Phew, okay. Don't destroy. Alright. Alright, there we go. Look how sad they get. I know. They're more surprised. They're just like, <gasps> what? Who's wrestling? Who do you oh, think? Was that the turkey? Yeah. Look at those Mets down there. I know. There Looks we go. Like he got the quick cold turkey. All right. Doing a no Don't damage ignore. run so far. Don't do ignore good? my puns. Sorry, I'm not trying to ignore you. So how you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> We're just waiting. Because <laughs> I could. Because I knew when the uh, the point when the uh, planes would come. Uh. Okay. Alright. There we go. Oh, come on! Never had that happen. Very disappointed. We fucking trouble. Never had that happen. Very disappointed. <laughs> Very disappointed myself. Jump 
Cobra. Nah, not that one. I know, but he burns. Okay, I'll be right back. Let's go. Okay. Remember to defend yourself. <sighs> Torch Jutsu. What are you gonna do? Ah! Do those fists block shots? Damn it! Damn it! Oh. Okay. It's okay, I've got eight more tries. Or really nine, because zero counts as one. Oh yeah, that's right. Perhaps you will be challenge. Fall to the fist of flames. Fall to the fist of flames. And then he does an afterburner. <laughs> I hate this part, because I always either get hit or I don't. See? Mm. <sighs> Alright. I can do this. I can do this. I know I can. He's the one that's just so unpredictable because I don't know what he's going to do after he does a a move, you know? Yeah. He seems to do afterburner kick more than his fucking sidekick. Yeah. Ugh. so difficult. It's so difficult. I feel like his sidekick and his afterburner kick should have like similar timings to Yeah. Them. Well, I think normal mode his uh, timing was a lot better. This one is just the hardest. See, I'm always prepared to like, after he does three, I'm always prepared that he's gonna do a fucking whatever kick. After burner kick? Yeah. <sighs> Damn it, I knew it. Oh, dude, he's got a fucking dragon head coming out of his feet. Yeah, you didn't know that? No. It's fucking awesome. I love his design and I love his character, but I just hate his fight. He's like, okay, so he's like Quick Man and Shadow Man to me, where their patterns are really unpredictable. Yeah. Funny how they both think, uh, how all three of them are, uh, live in the corners. Yeah. Did I ever tell you I did a no damage run with his boss fight? Oh yeah, you did tell me that. I was very impressed to hear that. This one did. No! I still got this. There we go! Ooh. There we go! Whew. I knew you did. You didn't lose as many lives as I initially thought you would. Oh god. Still lost a lot more than I thought I would. But, ugh, jeez. He's so unpredictable, and he he's the one that requires the most precise timing. 
You know, you have to have, like, literal quick thinking mm -hmm. in order to dodge him. You have to figure out what he's going to be doing next. And it's so difficult. Like, sometimes I feel like I have to predict have what he's going to be doing weapon? ahead. Have you gotten to use his weapon? Yeah, it's cool. I love his weapon yeah. so much. I fucking love it how he goes, Pia! In power, in power gear. <laughs> he fucking goes, Pia! Okay. It's so oh, are you sure? Yes. Are you sure? Are you sure? Man, for, for some sure? reason, I would always get the, um... Are you sure? The, uh, the fucking, um, bolt. Whatever thing. Hmm? Yesterday, I would just get it, like, immediately. The, um... The bolt increaser? Yeah, or whatever. The bolt, uh, discount. I would just get oh, it immediately. Yeah. And I was just, like... I'm just so... It's just so weird. How I don't... How I'm, like, not getting it now. Oh! I think it's because it happens more on Saturdays. Really? Yeah. Well, today's Monday. Yesterday, you said? It happened yesterday and Saturday. Hmm. So... Maybe it's just weekends for that. Maybe. That's so weird. I don't know why it's time sensitive, but... Well, anyways, next up is Impact Man, who is Dr. Wily number 87. Despite being a life bot. Yeah. Technically, he should be 87, 88, and 89. That's true. But they're not robot masters. Impact Man himself is a robot master. Mm. Ready. Yeah. How's the pizza? Is it good? I always get a bit antsy falling down that vertical shaft. Nah. I always get antsy around shafts, though. Yeah, any shaft. Especially, especially the, the priest kind. <laughs> that guy doesn't know when to fucking die. So I have some troubles with Impact Man stage. Um, I wouldn't say it's like really bad trouble. But the last time I played, I literally died in the beginning, and I didn't die ever since, so maybe it'll be fine. I don't know. Um, I actually do have a bit of trouble with Impact Man himself. Um, it's not necessarily hard, I just... I have trouble with this Power Gear form. This Power Gear form I find very easy. Um, at least I figured out the pattern. He's fucking fast as shit, dude. He is. Um, I have problems when he jumps, because I know when he jumps... It's, you know, it rumbles the ground, and, uh... Whoops. Dude, if this was Mega Man in base, they, they would not have those warning slider things. You know what I mean? Wait, what do you mean? Like, the things that come out before Impact Man slides through the walls. Oh, yeah. They wouldn't have that. Yeah, no, He'd no. just come out and fuck you up. Impact you. Impact! Still don't understand his, uh, fucking... Dracula voice going on. That is a bit weird. <laughs> Bam! Aw, oh, damn. Kind of weird how Dracula has never had that voice in the Castlevania series. That's true. But I guess maybe it's just... so generic. He's always had, like, dark sex. Yeah. Voice. Yeah. Well, except for Symphony of the Night's first English release, where he's just like, What is a man? Oh, yeah. This a little pile of secrets. Togami loves that, by the way. A miserable little pile of secrets. Woo! Can I not get hit by this boss? We'll have to see. This mid-boss the boss is fucking agonizing. Not really, not for me. For some reason, I've been doing pretty good, but, um... Uh... Knowing my run right now, I've been having a lot of issues. Shit. Great. He reminds me of Ground Scavenge in a lot of ways when he does that move. There we go. Got him. No damage, too. I mean, you, you wouldn't know because of the health, but if you watched me do it, yeah. Alright. I hate this part so fucking much. I would use Rush Jet here, but then I realized I need a Rush Coil for something else. And so oh, I was like, yeah. Yeah, uh, just for something cool. Ah! Shit! Nice. Ah! Uh, nice. 
<laughs> okay. Play it safe. That is so old. By the way, yes, that 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 um that thing shot would have hurt you. Yes, it does. I tested it. I thought it didn't because I was like, "Whoa, it didn't hurt me." But then it did. Yeah. You probably just had leftover eye frames up. Maybe. Okay. Can I do this I spend part so much without getting hit? I, I spend so much time charging this game that I never knew how many obstacles actually go down to just one regular buster shot. Oh, I that's something I always calculate. Because, like, those electric fences at the beginning of this stage, they just take a buster shot. Not even a charge. Skip. Right there. Uh, I'm impressed, honestly. Okay. Can I do this? Alright. Well, that guy's day was ruined. His entire reason for being, and you just fucked it over. <laughs> there we go. Woo! Perfect! Not so, a single hit. You're pretty good. I mean, not a single life. 640. Ugh, jeez. Alright, Impact Man, you fucker. I don't remember this being his battle background. Oh, this is it. This has been it. Okay. Hmm. What are you gonna do? You gonna jump or impact? Jump. Whoa. Impact! Impact! I actually love Impact Man's weapon, by the way. Oh, the pile driver? Oh, I love it. It's such a good weapon. Dude, I use it to skip so much oh, shit. Oh, everyone does it. It's so good. Shit. Ay, ay, ay. Maybe the idea is that he uses the power gear to split himself into multiple copies of himself. Ah, damn it! I or knew he was gonna die. Themself into multiple copies of themselves. Yeah, I think it's used to transform though, because he can like transform into like you know that one thing. I'm pretty sure he can use it to transform into other things as well, which would be really cool. Either way, out of all the construction themed bosses, this guy's probably my favorite. I probably agree. I'm not a big fan of those. Ugh. Like, I'm not a big fan of concrete man or stone man, but this guy, he's cool. I like him. Like, one of my favorite things about this entire game is just the bo uh, the fucking Robot Master designs. They're all great. Yeah, all of them are fantastic. Like, usually I have, like, that one or two Robot Masters per game where I'm like, eh. Yeah. But, no, here, I just love every single fucking one of them. Like, there's one side clearly is like more than There we other. go. <laughs> Look at Rock's face. <laughs> Wait, what happened? He just did his shaking animation like he shook the floor. He's just like, oh, oh, uh. it's, in slow motion. <laughs> he just did you, know what, you know what I love? Um, what? When you fight Guts Man, uh, sometimes I would I would be able to do it. But you know how when he jumps on the floor you get stunned? Yeah. <laughs> I would always pick up the item uh, while I, um, because you know how the item drops on the floor. Whenever you defeat him, I would always stay in that pose. When I pick up the item, so you know how it pauses? Yeah. Yeah. So I would just stay in that stunned face the whole time. <laughs> it's fucking awesome. Oh, where he has his eyes closed? Yeah. And he's just like, <laughs> Okay. Pile oh, drive. yeah, because he goes into his hurt animation. Sure. Yeah. Okay. I fucking hate sure? Guts Man. Yeah. I hate fighting him, I mean. Not Guts bad. Man himself is cool, but. Are you sure? Okay. Also, what is it with a sure? bunch of robot masters having the guts mouth? Even Otto has the guts mouth. <laughs> It must have been an early design. Okay. It's so good to see uh, you. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You haven't given me anything, you piece of shit. Uh, Can I borrow the PS2? Huh? You want to borrow it? Yeah. Okay. Sure. Okay, what What time are we at? Twenty five minutes. Okay. Let's finish this robot master. Watch the cutscene, and then we'll um. We'll go after Wiley. Yes. Which or will Willy. be something new for me. And I have a game over at once. Game end. <laughs> I'll game end of myself. Did I say it? I did. So, Bounce Man stage is probably the one I have the worst. You know what? You know stage. what Bounce Man looks like? You ever walked into like a Walgreens or something and picked up one of those like small electronic massager things with little balls at the end of them? Wait, what? And they like vibrate. Wait, what? 
Like, it's usually in a lot of pharmacies. It's like a, a small little electronic uh, massager. And it's got like these little vibrating balls at the end of a bigger ball. I've never. I. 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 I you've definitely seen. I it. probably have. I just don't know what you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, I'll, I'll explain it between episodes. But yeah. It, he just looks like one of those. I. To be honest, I think I know what you're talking about, but I really don't know. <laughs> you know, now that I'm not playing, I'm looking at the backgrounds a lot more and noticing stuff. Like, that was, uh, those are rock climbing walls. I never put that together. Oh, that's so cool! I just noticed it, too! Well, this is a park. This is like a... Yeah. Uh, well... <laughs> whoops. Um... That doesn't count. No. Yeah, you know what? Let's just fucking waste it. <laughs> While I'm sitting here having fun. Dude, do the Power Gear version. It takes more... Does it? Yeah. You're right, it does. Okay. Dude, Blockman's weapon is like the best. I love it. I love the idea of it too because it feels so useful. It does. The only one that feels useless is Acid Barrier, which yeah, we is have so to... weird because it's like, in my opinion, it's like the best like barrier weapon. No, no, no. A no, barrier no. weapon that can allow you to shoot. Well, no. Okay, you know, Jewel besides satellite. Jewel Satellite is just broken. Oh well, yeah, but that's for a very besides Jewel Satellite. It's a different take on barrier weapon, too. It is. It's like an actual... It's like a sonic shield. Yeah, it's not, you know, floating around you. Apparently the Power Gear version of it is really good, though. Oh, yeah, the Power Gear one is good. Ow! <laughs> Wrong way. See, uh, yeah, the reason I don't like these things in particular, the way they're used there, is because it makes you... It forces you... It pretty much forces you to either jump back up there, or make a jump that you're not sure about. Yeah. But I guess that's the idea. But this entire level is just fucking... Aye, aye, aye. Sp Springman had enough. Yeah. That's what this level is. Springman is pissed. Oh, come on! Ugh, I hate that one so... Oh, what? I have to start away from the beginning? Did you fight a mini-boss? No. But sometimes that does not the, that's not the case. I forget, is this your first level death? Hmm? This is your first level death. No. Hmm. I've had... Um... I think I had a couple on Blockman. No. That was before the embarrassment. Um... I can't remember. You didn't die in Fuse Man's level. Hmm, maybe it was. I don't know. But anyways, regardless of the case, Bounce Man stage is not that fun for me. Ugh. I don't I think it's that. fun for anybody. It's not really that fun of a stage. I love the idea. I love the theme. I love the backgrounds and everything. I just... It's just not fun. I just feel that it It just... It's just all the bounciness. There's way too much of it. Yeah. But regardless of the case, once you get that weapon... Ooh! Even Springman overdid a little bit. The perfect amount... Actually, of no. Springman did it right in my, in my opinion. I feel like Plantman did a little better. Perfect amount of sporing boing in this. Yeah. Which, I don't know why he had a... I don't know why he had the sporing boings. I hate that one so much right there, because it always Asshole gets close placement. Yeah. I usually take that guy out with a... Porchman's weapon. <sighs> I love his weapon. Ooh! Get away from me, I hate you. Torchman's weapon more. annihilates a certain part of the Wily stages. Ugh, I hate how they don't die in one shot. Ah! I'm gonna try to do more Buster runs of, uh, of x game because I feel like I don't really understand the bosses so much as I just take them out. I did that for Mega Man X. Um, it's... Spark Manual is really difficult without his weapon. Let me just say that. I mean, if you think about it... Ugh. I... Hate this! And then using his weapon just cripples him. You know what? I realize I've never done a Buster run of X1, so I have no idea what Spark Man Girl's moveset is like. Yeah, exactly. I hate this one too. You see, what I like about oh, no, the X series though is if you're going to do a Buster run, it kind of does let you choose an order because it can let you be like, uh, I can get the the heart upgrade here. 
and uh, that'll make it easier to fight. Yeah. Do you count using um? Do you count using weapons to get to get like heart upgrades as like breaking the run? No. It's a bit different. Ugh. It mostly really only applies for like a majority of the stage. Okay, let's hope I can do this. Well, this one, yeah, this this fight. This not one's that hard. easy, but these guys give me some trouble. Damn it! Oh, they only take off because of health, dude. I was gonna call that guy Pump Man, but uh, there's there's already a Pump Man. No! Oh! You died to Boy Orn. And I have to start from the beginning again. But uh, I had a feeling I was gonna. I don't like his stage. Ugh. It sucks because I love the idea of it. I just too much. Too much boy. Too. M I think the enemy placement is just also really bad. I feel like they shouldn't have placed so many enemies in certain areas. The gimmick is cool, but there's too much of said gimmick. Yeah. And then you have to fight the mini boss again with the fucking ugh. Good team though. Yeah. Just use Rush Jet. I could. I should, actually. <laughs> I think at one point I'd just say, fuck it, and just use a... What What kills the... the, pro the what is it? The proximity box of this game. The what now? Proximity box. Oh, um... Wait, what do you mean? The, uh... The ones that... The, the one that appears in every Mega Man game that fucking follows you around and shit. Like when you appear on the platform, it starts going ape shit. I, I, I don't know why. I don't. I, I'm not understanding what you're talking about. Like I'm the kidding. little one. Uh, there's a variation of it. Oh, oh, the yeah. Okay. Um, isn't it Impact Man? Man's what? I think that kills it because they're usually invincible. Yeah, I don't know actually. I haven't um, I haven't tested it. Maybe I'll have to test it out. Test what? Test it out the next time you see one. Yeah, I'll just do that. Ay ay I hate how this one also has respawning these guys as well. Who's got your favorite weapon? <laughs> ah, that's great. What? <laughs> the fucking just missing every time uh, due to bouncing. Yeah. Who's okay. got your favorite weapon in this game, by the way? Huh? Oh, there you go. Try it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, uh oh. Well. Well, I uh, don't know. No. I know that the chain blast doesn't kill it, because I tried that. Yeah, no, it doesn't. Nope. No. Nope. Really? I'm kind of scared to try it. Uh. Oh, wow! The regulars. Ah! It's killing all the ones that appear in every Mega Man game. Oh, that's funny. No! No! So I guess that includes wall blasters, the side-to-side -side bots. Yeah. Uh, proximity bots, those guys right there. There's a variation of those guys in every Mega Man game. Ooh. Hello. At least I'm getting a lot of fucking bolts. Yeah. I really need them. I know. Fuck you! You really got killed by one of those things. Oh, Jism. This is the worst. I, I've never had this much trouble. So this is quite embarrassing. Ooh. Oh, it's gone. Fine. Well, you off screen it. Yeah, I know. But what were you expecting? I don't know. This could be there. A like lap dance? No. I wouldn't expect a lap dance. Ugh, from you? No, not from me. Gross. Okay. Rubber glove. It's so much faster. I might as well just do that. Well, I don't really like using Rush yet because it wastes so much, um... Uh... It wastes so much energy. It's a weapon tank, baby. I know, but... What was with the nerf to the weapon tank in Mega Man 10? That was so stupid. I don't know why. 
I don't know. What, what, what was the point? I don't know. I guess they just wanted to make it. Well. Sleepy slap. <sighs> this is silly. You put yourself in a silly situation. God damn it! <laughs> Completely. <sighs> Try not to touch the balloons because I know they're going to hurt me. Too risky to spring you boy your way. Okay. Get me the fuck out of here. Time to rush out of here. <laughs> <laughs> I like how you're laughing there was timed perfectly for that guy being no <laughs> knocked back and forth. He's like <laughs> <laughs> I hate this part so much. I hate this channel. Damn it. Okay. There we go. There we go. Uh, I didn't mean to call for you. There we go. You call me, Master? We're gonna throw the ball around again? I will throw the ball. I don't have the ball yet. <laughs> oh, not the mega ball. No, not the ball. I'm talking about the rebound. Uh. Oh, oh, right. I was talking about the mega ball in Mega Man 8. That was a good weapon. It was, but I missed Rush. Yeah, same. Like, come on, they reduced him to bike. Yeah. Bike isn't as cool as spring... spring. Well, bike is not as cool as spring dog. I hate this stage so much. Also, do you do you like the original Mega... Uh, the original Rush uh, coil design, or do you like the, the one-time five design? Uh... The one-time five design was a bit weird. I like the original. Yeah. I don't know why it was like that in that game. Well, I guess they just wanted to do something cool. I guess, but I didn't even go as high. Yeah, but you had to do the extra jump. I guess I, I felt a bit more stable. There we on go. Him. I usually never have troubles with that boss, so that was just. And then Rush wasn't even. Yeah, I, that's one thing I was also disappointed with with Mega Man 6. As much as I like the power and flight armors, I did miss Rush. Yeah. Like, there's just something about having your dog on your adventure, you know? Yeah. It's also weird because fuck you. People, I hate those guys. People consider people consider the height of the series Mega Man 2, but it's like that one I didn't ever kill that Eddie. That one didn't have Rush. It's like how are you gonna call Mega Man 2 the best when it doesn't have Dog? Yeah, Dog is best. That's why I love Mega Man 3. Even if it does have um. Mega Man 3 introduced a lot of staples. It introduced Rush, Proto Man, sliding. Yeah. Even if Proto Man was pretty shit. I feel like he was probably just fucking with you for a little bit. Yeah. By the way, I, I laughed so much at the, the, the Wily Wars port because they didn't even change uh, Proto Man's sprite in that Oh, game. yeah, I know. I was so disappointed in that. I was and, like, and come on. And because of that, you're way taller than him. It was so fucking stupid. What? Just gonna fucking hit by that guy. Oh, yeah, I know. I didn't mean to. Well, of course he didn't mean to. Dude, the explosions just are so satisfying in this game. Yeah, I know. Ah! Idiot. Blast Man approves of it. Yeah. These are Blast Man approved explosions. God darn Stupid bounce! God darn Manitan! <laughs> you son of a bitch! <laughs> no nut. For I forget you. because if you if you go too far. You can't jump as high. You're not allowed to jump as high, or else if you do... <laughs> I'm just reminded of when Vinny played this. He just kept referring to the bolts as nuts. And it's <laughs> like, is this a place to grind for nut? <laughs> <laughs> ah, damn it, I knew I, I jumped too early. You know that somebody out there has a fetish for this entire level. Yeah, probably. Now it's really a place to grind for nut. Oh no! Am I all the way back here? Yes, I am. This is gonna be where I game over. I bet you. This is where I'm gonna fucking game over. I mean, besides the block man. I mean, uh, nothing happened. Uh. Is that a vault holding ball? Yeah. <laughs> it's a vault ball. It's yeah. a ball vault. Well, they don't want they don't want people stealing the balls. 
Nobody's gonna scare. Something tells me those that just. By the way, up. you know what's funny? What? The whole time I thought, uh, I was gonna say Boing Man. Um, <laughs> Bowsman was like an aerobics instructor, and he kind of is in a sense. I just found it funny. Yeah. Cause he looked like it too. The way he's got like spandex on, he looks like one of those like. 90s. I feel like the actual bot himself was like really thin and tall. Oh yeah, I was thinking um a good idea to have the robot masters be playable is that um you know you can inflate or deflate and be like super thin or super. Oh now you're really making the deviant artist nut. <laughs> We're grinding for nut now. Also, there's a blimp in the background. Yes, I know. It's going to the glitz pit. Okay, here we go. Hello, Bull. How many Hello. I got? Oh god, look how many I've got. Hello, Nut. <laughs> <laughs> well, it was worth it. You got a flashlight. What? You mean a flashlight? No. Actually. There we go. Not that. Yeah, okay, um, I forgot. Apparently somebody was complaining about, like, Oh, I hate this dude, or I hate this game, because, the uh, they, they kept getting stuck at that part. <sighs> Just let go of the fucking button. Yeah. Just readjust yourself. Don't sit readjust there. Yourself? No, he kept doing it. He kept doing it. It's like, buddy. <laughs> buddy. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> okay. Oh. Tongue. I hate you. Get in my way. I would. I wouldn't even bother trying to spray him with bullets before he starts lifting himself. Like, I would really just focus on getting a good charge shot in on him on that phase. Maybe. Is his entire- Whoops. Uh, that didn't happen. Is his entire body susceptible to- I don't know, I usually start spamming when he- when he starts- Is it just his mouth and eye area that you can- Yeah, right it's here? only the mouth and eye area. God! Yeah, you should be dead soon. There we go. There we go. Ugh, I've never had him go through for Fire a third wins. phase. Booty. There we go. I hate that part. I've, I've, to I've posted it on Twitter why I hate that part. Ooh! This entire area reminds me of, uh... And here's where I died. This my first time. This entire area reminds me of Spring Man's little... Like, I wonder specific... why! No, this is... Uh, this... Part right here, because oh. it reminds me of that one room where it's like you got the upgrade to the top left, the uh, like, super bolt. Yeah. What's it called? The hyper bolt? Uh, whatever it is. Which, by the way, I just want to say this: Otto is missing. He misses that like throughout the rest of the games. <laughs> yeah, I like know. he just loses it. He, and just he never lost gets it again. It back. I feel like Springman took it back. <laughs> like that's that was me. mine. That's my nut. You can't have it. No nut. Damn it! You. Stupid robotic. Plus, Balloons. to be honest, let's be real, I don't look really fucking stupid with that thing coming out of his head. I guess, but I feel there's always something missing, though. Yeah, it's his nut. <laughs> Otto cannot nut. Because how can you nut with no bolt to get nuts out of? <sighs> okay. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm taking the nut joke too far. No, it's okay. Keep, keep going. I love the nut jokes. You love the nut? Let it, be, let it be known that Connor has stayed. He loves the nut. Of course. I love the nut when it's sprayed all over my face, too. How do you spray nuts? They're, they're fucking... Never mind. What, whatever. <laughs> I'm not taking this any further. Finally! Bounce man! You will be mine, you piece of shit! Aw, that's so sweet. You want to marry him? Aw, he's pretty cute. Bubba Bounce Man! Oh, By is the that way, the one he, he said? He takes forever to say his second response. Oh, does he? Yeah. Shit. Ah. Oh, I guess you can. What if they added this guy to arms? Dude, that would be fucking awesome. I was trying to rem uh, remember who this guy reminds me of, and it's Helix. From arms. Yeah! Boy. One more. There we go! Woo! Simple and clean, unlike his fucking level. Three times over. I haven't had any fucking pizza. Smash attack now. Mm. <laughs> fucking. Alright. <laughs> <sighs>
Finally, all the Robot Masters defeated. You know the sprite for Mega Man came before the official design? I thought that was Sonic. No, that was Mega Man. Really? Yeah. How do you say that? Because the uh, Keiji Inafune... Keiji Inafune oh, built the design looking at the sprite. I hate Tessa's weapon again. I fucking love it. I love how it makes a squeaky noise too. Yeah, when the balls disappear. It's literally just a better rebound striker from uh, Mega Man 10. I know, it's fucking awesome. By the way, it was so, it was so funny how I figured it out. I had a feeling... You can aim it up too, by the way. Oh yeah, that's right, you can aim it up and down. I didn't know that. I did not know that. Yeah, this is why I like to test the weapon, because um, they, they have the actual uh, instructions up there. This is probably the best um, weapons like system, in my opinion, just because they teach you how to use weapons. And there's a... You can test the weapon yourself. Yeah. I absolutely love that. Because something I don't like about games like Mega Man 2 or Mega Man 4, they just say, oh, you changed his color and he got a new weapon. How does it work? I don't know. Why don't you go fucking use it? The oh, wait, guess what? You the power it. is your purple now. Yeah. Oh, plus, do we even have to mention the transforming weapons now? That's so fucking cool. Oh, yeah, totally. And um, I kind of hope that they have DLC weapons. And uh, they do some of the older Robot Masters. Give it to me. Uh, give that to me in X9. Oh yeah, that would be fucking awesome. And while All you're right. at it, why not make that cutscene? Linking this back to the Ultimate Road, make that downloadable oh, skins no. for Mega Man. Any idea where Wily's gone to? Uh, he's totally vanished, Mega Buddy. Maybe he decided to turn tail and run. Huh? What is it, Otto? Uh, there's someone hijacking our signal! C could it be? Indeed it could! My genius neither runs nor hides! Wily! Light than you, Mega Man! How dare you use my double gear system! Now you've crossed the line, I'll turn you into scrap myself! I'm at point E1685578. Come to my gear fortress. I'll be waiting for you. Gear fortress? That's all we needed. I'm heading out, Dr. Light. Hmm. It's time to finish this. Good luck, Mega Man. It's up to you to stop, Dr. Wily. Yes, sir. You can do it, Mega Man! Mega, be careful out there. Okay. Do that. Shit, I sealed my feet. Oh boy. Oh boy. I can finally play something new. Hey, oh, sure? I'm sorry for interrupting the cutscene earlier before, by sure? the way. That's okay. Are you sure? Are you sure? I'll keep it in. Are you sure? Alright, we'll have to see you guys in the next episode. I gotta go buy a bunch of shit. What do I feel like there's probably if there was a, what do I feel like there's a, if there's ever like a, a show for a Mega Man that's more like faithful to the series? And there's gonna be one episode that is about Dr. Light getting mad because nobody notices what's different about him, and all it is is that he's wearing blue pants instead of red. <laughs> That would be fucking awesome. Dr. Light. By the way, do you know that young Dr. Light was wearing blue pants? Yeah, I know. It was pretty cool. He graduated. Uh... Alright. After this episode, we're gonna kill ourselves. Yeah. Never gonna play Mega Man 11. We're gonna beat it. Yeah. Alright, we'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye. Continue. Continue.